All right, we are live guys. What is going on? It's Brando here with another video and I just want to tell you guys some tips, some ideas, all right, to give you guys kind of an overview of, you know, making money online and how much people make online. Now, obviously, uh, I can't promise you guys results here if you follow what I share with you. And uh, these are just my thoughts and experiences when it comes to blogging, when it comes to internet marketing, making money online, and uh, the amount of money that people can make, all right? And these are just numbers that I've seen in my life, all right? Other people, you know, results are gonna vary. It depends on the work you put in, how consistent you are, just like anything in life. If you wanna be a pro NBA player, all right, you don't just step on the court and you shoot baskets whenever you feel like it. You do it every day, religiously, consistently. Like when you go to bed, you are going to get up in the morning. All right, maybe you might get up late, but you're gonna get up, okay? You have to do the same when it comes to something that you want to master, when it comes to something you wanna get results in. So the uh, the question I'm kinda covering today, guys, um, from my experience and my opinion, if you don't agree with it, exit off the video, is like how much can you see a blogger or a vlogger making from a post that they put on? And it doesn't work like that. Um, the reality is everyone wants to make money quick. Everyone's got this idea of getting rich quick. And if that is you, exit off this video. Because the reality is when it comes down to making money per post, all right, the only way you do that is building an audience first. You see, when you have a blog, you put a blog out there. You're brand new. Nobody knows who you are. You maybe share it on social media to your friends and family. But nobody really is going there every single day checking out your stuff. Very very little. Maybe one person does in the beginning. That's it. And it's your best friend because they feel bad for you because they think you're crazy. All right. But other than that, there's nobody going there. So what you need to do is you need to start getting more traffic to your actual blog, to your site. How do you do that? Well, you post more and more content every single day. Quality and quantity matters, all right, when it comes to blogging. Quality and quantity. And you want to use other distribution centers, distribution centers being social media, Instagram, Pinterest, YouTube, uh, Facebook. You want to use those as your outlets to market yourself to as well because that's where everyone is. So if you can post a YouTube video, post a YouTube video. Snapchat it, Snapchat it. Instagram it, Instagram it. All right, utilize all of social media and point the links back all of your social media accounts, point them back to your blog. So that way people on social media, they'll click your link, they'll go back to your blog, and after you do that for a consistent period of time, you know, do it for a year straight, you'll see a big loyal following afterwards. If you set a high standard for yourself and you make a commitment that, hey, you know, I wanna get 100,000 readers on my blog every single month to my blog. Set a goal for yourself like that, 100,000 in a year. Okay, 100,000 readers on my site every single month in a year. I'm gonna do it, that's it, period. And just begin creating content consistently and make sure it's content that you are passionate about. So then once you have that in place, okay, you've built your audience, you have a following, how you make money and how you make money per post, all right, is through advertising, typically. All right, it's through Google AdSense. When people come and they look at your blog, you're gonna get paid. Now, the pay to ratio, for it is usually through CPMs, which is cost per thousand, all right, cost per thousand views. And the average for that, I mean, I mean it differs, but the average for it for most, you know, YouTubers and, and video bloggers um, is about a dollar CPM, all right? When you're starting out, you get paid about a dollar per thousand views. So every time you get a thousand people to your website that view an advertisement, they just view it, they don't have to click it. Every thousand people that view it, you're gonna get paid about a dollar, all right? because advertisers are paying Google to be seen and when people from your site are seeing the ad, you're gonna get paid from that because that's your traffic, okay? And I hope that makes sense. So if you wanna make $1,000 a month, you gotta get you know, uh, about a million people you know, to, to your site every single month, okay? Um, but that's easy to do if you're consistent. If you think about the big picture, you, you won't even be motivated to do it. But if you have a big reason why and you're very motivated, you can definitely do it. But I hope that makes sense, guys. It's about a dollar CPM. That's how it works. And then when people click on it, you can make more money. But you can't do a fraud click. You know, you can't click it multiple times hoping you're going to get paid big bucks. It does not work like that. Okay, Google has algorithms in place where that is going to be a spam click. All right. So uh, I hope that makes sense, guys. Another way bloggers do get paid is doing product reviews. So companies will reach out to you if you have a big following and uh, they will give you a product that you have to do a review on. So some company, if you have a big following, they will send you this pen for free. You get to keep it and they'll send you multiple pens or whatever the product is. And all you have to do is mention the product in the company in your video 
and they will pay you not only giving you the product for free, but they'll pay you maybe like 500 bucks or a thousand dollars. All right. To just talk about it and do a review post on it or a video on it. All right. So companies will reach out to you as well. Those are really the two ways ads and, you know, doing product reviews or even selling a product on your website. Okay. You can do affiliate marketing, reselling other people's products, but it all comes down to marketing. It all comes down to learning to get people to your stuff. So I hope that makes sense, guys. I hope you really enjoyed this video as much as I did putting together for you. And if you are more interested in building a business or an income through the internet, if you're serious about it, and uh, you want to be able to build a leveraged income online, whether it's selling products online or selling your own products online. If you're interested in this kind of stuff, I have a five video training series that I put together on my website. It's linked down below in the description on how I was able to go from working as a baker in a restaurant to creating in a couple of months a full time income business online, selling affiliate marketing products. So if you're interested in this, you can go check it out. If not, then I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care and peace.